welcome to today's video. The interior designer series are back. You guys love all my room decorating videos. So today I am taking down all my Christmas decorations and putting out winter ones. I'm gonna do like a rose gold, light pink, gold, wintry, snowy kind of look for my new bedroom. This bedroom will only stay up for a little bit because I mean spring comes in like Marchish. Marchish. <laughs> That's a good word, Annie. I kind of can't keep my Christmas decorations up till spring, so this is what I'm gonna do for my bedroom in between. I sound a little congested today, I know. I'm sorry about that. But there's lots of different steps that we need to do in order to start doing the bedroom. One of the steps that's gonna be coming up in this video is I'm attempting to get my bed back. So I don't know how this is gonna turn out, but basically a long, long time ago, somewhere around spring, I saved up all of my money and bought myself a new bed because my bed was just, it's a twin and it wasn't great and the twin bed just didn't look good in the bedroom that I was in and all that. So I bought myself a bed and it was super expensive and all that. But then a little while later, I really wanted my sister to move into my little area with me. But my sister did not have a bed and since my sister was moving in, she was gonna move into the bedroom where my bed that I bought was. And so I was like, oh, that's okay. I'll just move into a different bedroom and blah, blah, blah. And I'll take my bed. But the bed didn't fit and we didn't know how to take it apart. So today we're gonna try to finally take it apart because I miss my bed and it seems weird that like I bought myself this bed and my sister's using it. I really wanted her company like in the apartment. We're gonna get it back. I'm gonna move the bed into my current bedroom. My sister is gonna get a new bed obviously. I'm not gonna just like leave her with nothing. But I'm really really excited. That's gonna be a very hard task because first of all we're gonna see if we can take it apart ourselves because like we're committed today. But if we can't we're gonna call rooms to go which is where I got my bed and do all that. But the very first step of the whole entire day is I need to evaluate my room and start just taking down and storing away all of my red items and Christmassy things, all my pillows and stuff so my room is just a blank canvas that I can work with. I'm super excited to see how my room's turned out so make sure to stop this video right now and go down below and subscribe to my channel and yeah let's get straight on with the video. Okay guys it's really dark <laughs> I love that. I have a huge box here and it's time for me to take all of my pillows off my bed. That'd be awkward. I can't hear you, Jed. There's one left. We got the Christmas tree out, and look at all of the dust it left. Like, how rude. But look how sad this is. Actually, it's not that bad. Here is my empty room. It looks so, like, sad. I made an aesthetic for my room. It's starting to get dark outside, so like, this is, you know, it's kind of hard to see, but, hi! <laughs> this is all of like the type of things I'm gonna be putting in my room once we've gotten the furniture and the bed. We also stripped my bed in here. We stripped it so that it's ready to be moved and we're gonna move it. Ah! the bed. My mom is actually at the grocery store so I need to kill time and I am going to take up the carpet and move this desk and my vanity over here that you can't see where I want it to go because I'm actually going to put that there and my vanity here so I can do that and then we have like room to move out the bed and stuff so I'm going to do that and I'm not sure if I'm going to keep this carpet or move in my pink carpet so I'm just going to take this out because I haven't decided yet what carpet I want. Time my mom just got my bed. I thought it was gonna be a lot like super hard, but my mom did it. She took it apart and brought my bed in here. And this is what I love most and what I miss most about this bed. Oh, and also underneath the bed, I don't know where or why she found it, 
but I have a January 2019 calendar. I totally forgot I bought this. And I'm gonna put it probably above my bed because there's a lot of room out there. But I'm so excited! It's already dark. So now I'm just gonna start moving in decorations. And also in this little corner, I'm gonna put a little chair that I'm getting from my closet because I didn't have anywhere to put it, so I just put it in my closet. But this looks so cute. If you guys are wondering what this is, I literally have no idea either, so. my eye in a branch because I went outside. So that's amazing, that's why I don't go outside a lot. The room is almost done and we actually needed bedding and sh we actually still need bedding and sheets for my bed because we don't know where my white bedding went that I had like previously when I had this bed. And also, I don't think we own any double sheets so we're gonna have Lily pop down to Target and just get some sheets because I don't have any apparently. The room is looking so good. A few moments later. So Lily just got home even though it looks like I literally haven't moved. She got bedding and sheets in that bag and she also got Chick-fil-A. Let's go. I'm so happy. Here's the bedding and sheets. Ooh, these are so soft. Yay, go Lily. She did something right. Just kidding. <laughs> Actually, the next day, my room is complete and I'm obsessed. I literally love it. Like, I went to sleep last night just staring at my room and I'm just like... So, thank you guys so much for watching. Y'all won't get to see the finished room tour till tomorrow. Sorry, my Apple Watch keeps going off. Tomorrow, that's pretty soon. All you gotta do is watch some more of my videos and then all of a sudden it'll be the next day and you can watch my tour. Thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. I hope it inspired you to do your bedroom and I hope you have a good New Year's. Bye!